Everything, 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 everything else. In the nineties, we lost our way. Lost it. the nineties to the present. To the present. I'm not nostalgic. I'm not nostalgic. I, I think it's tragic, y'all. We had so much. We had so much. We are so out of touch. It's gonna take a miracle. It's gonna take a miracle. It's gonna take a miracle. Ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, gotta talk to you. I got this. Somebody gave a suggestion, and I'm gonna take their suggestion. I'm doing a writ writ of certiorari to the United States Court of Appeal for the Ninth Circuit Court. And what I'm doing, y'all, I want y'all to understand, I'm challenging the United States Code. What, 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 say what? I'm challenging the United States Code. It's unconstitutional, all the errors in it and everything. Now, I don't went, I, I don't went to chat GPT and I said explore GPTs, and I went and looked for paralegal, and sure enough, I found a paralegal. Now, which one is this? Hold on, let me see which one is this uh, about. Let's click on about. This is this paralegal. See that little image right there? That's that one. And you know what? I tried two of them, and this one seems to be the better one. So I'm going to give that person some credit, okay? Because it's actually doing the writ, putting the page numbers. I just told somebody today I was adding page numbers, and this one did it without me even prompting it to add it. So whoever prompted this one prompted it pretty good. Okay, now notice this. It gives this stuff right here. We can fill all that in later. But then it does this right here. It gives me, now pay attention, Title 18, 3231. This says they should have jurisdiction over all criminal matters. Hold on, ladies and gentlemen. Includes limitations not found in the USC. The statutes at large includes limitations that the USC does not have there. Uh-oh. Now look at that. It gives me my discrepancies in the code people are being convicted under these codes all day all air day okay air day now anyway continue with the list of 65 discrepancies as required i'm gonna get them to give me my continuation because i said 65 but i'm gonna let it do what it do now my chat gpt it ain't doing that this one Oh, by the way, this one's free. That's right, free. You get access to it for free. A code not enacted as positive law may be evidence of the law, but does not carry the force of law itself. Ladies and gentlemen, even if they did say it was evidence of the law, too bad. It's still not law. It can be evidence of the law. Well, show me the law. A copy is not, not evidence. Uh-oh. Uh oh, it says I've reached my limit. Oh no. Oh snap. I can't use it then, dude. No, I'm, I'm going to stick here. I don't mind that limit. Uh uh. Give me one second. When it said it wasn't going to include it, we're going to get it to include all of them. That's right. Where is it? Where is it at? I just, I got to scroll down, y'all. He didn't give me my complete list. I need the completed list. Oh, it's at the bottom of this row right here. Uh-uh. I asked for 65. That's grounded, mo proof. 65. Wake up. You will rewrite and include all 65 as requested. Even if you have to do it in five segments. Stop listening. Oh, snap. I just read it, y'all. It says I can't go any further. It says I done used all my limits. I done gone past the limit. Minute by minute. Five minute, five minute. I keep holding on. I keep holding on. Doo, doo, doo. Minute, five minute, five minute, five. I keep holding on. 
All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is a different ChatGPT. This is the paid one. Now, hold on now. Let me show y'all something so y'all can pay them attention. Explore ChatGPT. Then we're going to do P-A-R-A-L-E-G-A-L. Paralegal. Ta-ding. 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 That's her right there. I, see, I, I remember her. I can spot her from any place. Any, 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 any place. We got to go all the way from up here, all the way down here. Now, hold on. Let's see if she going to give me what I'm asking for. We're doing a lot better this time, y'all. Ooh-wee. We doing a whole lot better. Now, she ain't going to give me all 65, but I get her to do 65 separately. Ladies and gentlemen, I am going to be attacking these statutes at large and these uh, so-called codes that everybody else seems so addicted to. Ladies and gentlemen, the code is not law. Watch this. Wake up. Wake up. I asked you for all 65 of the codes with their discrepancies comma you are not following instructions stop listening It's going to give me all 65 codes, ladies and gentlemen. Y'all going to love me. I keep saying it. I, I Look, anybody else telling you the code is not law? We got so many people in jail right now because they were convicted according to a stupid code that isn't law. Every federal court goes by the code, people. Even the federal judiciary goes by Title 28. The only thing that's so-called legal is the title, the code, the subsections, and the subchapter are not law. They are not positive law. Only the title is positive law, according to Congress, not the code. The code has mistakes in it. This is your rebutting the so-called evidence. Oh, no, they're going to be... Another point I'm going to be bringing in this writ of certiorari. Okay, there are three points. One of them is that mortgages are not security. Supreme Court said it's a rebuttable presumption. I'm going to be challenging that presumption. Then we're going to be challenging the Gonzalez versus Castle Rock decision. Supreme Court said that the police do not owe an obligation to the people unless they can prove it. Well, I can prove the police owe an obligation to the people. Pay attention. Defund the police. That statement in and of itself is your prima facie evidence that the police owe an obligation to the people because it's the people who fund the police department, i.e. the phrase, defund the police. Wake up. Now incorporate them into my writ, comma. You will also incorporate the point that we're challenging, the Supreme Court's decision when it said that a promissory note is not a security if it has a maturity date of less than six or nine months, comma, when the Banking Act of 1933 and the Securities Act of 1933 each identifies promissory notes as securities. And it specifically says any notes, which includes promissory notes. Comma, this rebuts the Supreme Court's presumption that a promissory note is not a security, exclamation mark. And then we're going to rebut the Supreme Court's decision in Gonzalez versus Castle Rock, where the Supreme Court stated that the police owed no duty or obligation to the public, period. The duty police owe is to the citizenry. civilian population, comma, open quote, defund the police, close quote. 
a phrase coined by the people gives evidence and proof that the police are funded by the public. And since they are funded by the public, there is a duty under basic contract law for value and consideration. Comma, they receive the value, they must extend the consideration, and the consideration is the protection that is implied by funding a police force. Exclamation mark. You are to add these two challenges to this complaint. Forward slash writ. And I need it to be more professional. Stop listening. Hey, I'm just letting y'all know. Um, that I'm impressed with the person who put together a prompt for this. I don't have the time to be sitting up here training it like this person did, but they did a very good job because he is doing exactly what he should be doing. Okay? And this is your example, ladies and gentlemen. So from now on, when I'm doing legal stuff, you better believe it's right here. It's right here from now on. From now on. Let's do this right here. We're going to We're going to keep it right there. Oh, you you ain't finished? You got mo? Oh, snappity wappity poopity wappy papa poopa wow. Okay, let's do this for you guys so that you guys can understand. It only gave me 9. Okay, but I not worried about that nine because guess what <laughs> it gave me 65 up here okay so i ain't worried how you do so far you're gonna get that right there okay you get your feedback now get on out of my way go on now go on now that that will pump that person up. pump 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 them up okay that'll pump that person up it says wet summarization. <laughs> it ain't supposed to say wet, but that's, you know, that's this voice recognition because the speaker is so far away. Uh, but there you go, ladies and gentlemen. We have our writ, and what I will do is I will add to the writ the sections that I need to add. I just needed the structure. That's what it did. It gave me my table of contents. Did it give me my table of authorities? Gave me my table of authorities. Look at that. Gave me my maxims of law. And gave me my Supreme Court opinions omitting citations. Then it gives me opinions below from the court. The Ninth Circuit Court of Appeals, blah, 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 reporter volume, blah, 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 opinion of the United States District Court, blah, blah, blah. I, we don't have a district court, but we all have a district court. We all have a district court because that's where I'm headed. You see... Supreme Court made the decision, so I'm going to be doing a writ of certiorari to the United States Supreme Court. In a case that I had in Puerto Rico, they blocked my appeal. I'm not playing. I told you I don't let nothing go. You see, it's a continual deprivation since they denied me the right to an appeal. They said there was a warrant out for my arrest. I don't have any warrants out for my arrest. They had an opportunity to come and enforce whatever warrant. And so now we're going to go back before the court on writ of cert. The warrant doesn't exist anymore. So we're going to bring these other challenges along with the original appeal where I'm speaking on my own behalf, where they ordered oral arguments. But one way or another, we're going to take care of things. All right. I just thought I'd share this with you guys. Those of you who need to produce legal documents, ta-da! Have a good day. We will talk, okay? Take care, everyone.